Hi loves, it's Shonda. How are you? And welcome to Shonda Says. Today is Wednesday, which means we're all pink up in here today. Yes, yeah, a pink room day. And I'm going to tell you right now that my sexy, unabashed, unedited twin is going to be recording today. So this video I'm going to tell you right now is not safe for work because today my language, I just want to speak very frankly. So we're going to have fun today. Um, this video is inspired literally by good dick. Yeah, I said that. Yeah, by good dick. Now I'm saying this because I've never talked about being whipped on Shonda Says ever especially well did I I don't think I, I mean I would have remembered if I talked about this subject and you know many of us women many of us girls we talk about how you know a man may be shit and be no good for you but the way he performs in bed and the way he just tears your ass up it doesn't matter all the crazy stuff he does and um, I'm gonna say this for men too I know that I've heard of the saying crazy pussy is good pussy <laughs> where you're you've been with a woman who's just nuts like she's just crazy she's off the wall she's screaming yelling acting a fool ratchet ghetto but when she get in that bed she know how to handle her business and it keeps you staying in a situation that you probably shouldn't be in. So I thought it would be fun to talk about. I have a question. Have any of you ever been whipped? Has somebody ever put that thing on you so good that you see past all their faults and all their craziness and all their madness? Um, let's talk Shonda. Have I ever been whipped? I bet you would like to know. Um, I, I like to do the whipping. <laughs> I like to be the one that's doing the whipping, but have I ever been whipped? Um, I would say I have. I, I definitely would say I have. I am. Um, there have been times that I've I've done things that I know that you know this is not good for me but the sex is so good that I really just don't care yeah I just I just don't care and I say to my friends don't look into the little eye you know what I'm talking about yeah that little that opening don't look into that straight out like don't look it in the eye cuz it'll hypnotize you <laughs> Yeah, this is like a crazy video, I know. But, you know, sex is so intoxicating. And I, oftentimes we don't want to admit how much uh, intoxicating sex is and how how much we need it. I'm one of those people that I don't mind saying how much I need it and how much um, it's part of who I am as a woman and, and part of um, what I love doing. I love making love. I love intimacy. I'm not afraid of that. I'm a very passionate woman. As you know, I always say that, but I am. I'm very passionate, very romantic. And um, that's why I have the pink room because I can come in here and talk about these subjects. And you know, we could be a little naughty sometimes. So I thought it would be fun to talk about being whipped. Now, what are the qualities of a man that'll have you whipped? Let's think about that. Size matters. I'm not going to lie. There's nothing like a, a big Johnson. That, honestly. Now, if it's not that big, it should be fat. Like it should have girth. You know? should be wide. Um, also, foreplay is really huge. Like, a man that knows how to you know, work, I'm going to say work those titties, work a woman's clit, work 
her toes, her neck. You know, um, I even like a man that talks a lot. And I've mentioned that before. But just, you know, while he's saying, while he's doing stuff, he's talking. And it's like all of the senses are involved, you know. But um, I'm going to wrap this video up before it gets too crazy or gets too hot in here. It turns from pink to red. <laughs> so in your comments today, tell me, have you ever been whipped? And um, as a man, what are qualities in a woman that'll have you acting a fool? I know one thing, that head game better be right. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway, I love you guys. You know, this is the pink room. We can go here, here. That's what I do. That's what I do. I'm that girl. I love you guys, and we'll talk soon. Um, if I don't see you, have a great weekend. Give me a kiss. You know I love my kisses. Mwah. And um, don't forget to leave your comments. I'm so interested in what you have to say today. Yeah. I love you. Bye-bye.